thousands of emperor penguins cluster on the ice of Atka Bay in Antarctica, mostly unaware that an interloper lives among them. Slightly shorter than the average adult emperor, the three-foot-tall autonomous robot sits silently within the colony, nondescript compared with humans who sometimes emerge from a nearby research station. What does the robot do? As stock predators, emperor penguins are ideal species to study in a fluctuating ecosystem because they can reveal if something is wrong. By studying these birds, the robot helps scientists and researchers learn about the impacts of the climate crisis in Antarctica. Surprisingly, little is known about these penguins because Antarctica isn't the easiest place for scientists to access. Why a robot? Although it's crucial to learn more about the penguins and their ecosystem, scientists didn't want to introduce a harmful human footprint in an already vulnerable environment or adversely affect the colony. A successful trial of the robot this year is already showing how that may be possible. Eco, the robot. The robot Eco acts like a receiving station because it's mounted with wireless receivers automatically retrieving data from the penguin sensors. The robot is a supplement to SPOT or Single Penguin Observation and Tracking Observatory at the German Antarctic Research Base. With Eco, they don't miss out on a chance to collect data as Eco helps in tracking and studying penguin behavior over time. The researchers can observe how these animals adapt to their environment shifts due to climate change. Bureau Report, The Metro.